talk about the Video Bar 70. The Video Bar 70 is an all-in-one collaboration bar. So this has everything built in for you. You can literally put it in a room, connect up your touch screen, and you don't need to add anything else. This solution is geared for your medium to large conference rooms, and it has four cameras built into it, uh, and it's packed with really cool intelligent video features. Tell me about the technology. The Video Bar 70 has both a group framing experience and an enhanced speaker tracking experience. So when you are in the speaker tracking mode, you have the ability to have a picture in picture of the wide view of the room and the active speaker, as well as that uh, composition view where you're able to see not only the person who's currently speaking, but the person who spoke before that. So uh, there are four cameras here. Uh, how does it create those experiences? The camera in the top has the widest field of view. This is going to be utilized for the group framing experience. That way you're able to see everybody in the room and ensure that they're all seen by the remote participants. It's also going to be used for the closer uh, participants when you're in the speaker tracking mode of the video bar 70. Additionally, you have those three cameras down in the base. These cameras have a narrow field of view and the reason they have this is to be able to clearly capture people who are farther away. And the narrow field of view has a higher pixel density. That way when you crop that image down, you're able to retain a clearer image. What do we need to know about placement? So when you're placing this camera, the main consideration you need to take a look at is the field of view for that top camera. Uh, you want to make sure that in the group framing mode that everybody in the room can be seen. The furthest person that uh, can be framed by this solution it should be about 25 feet away from the camera. So you wanna make sure you're placing this in the appropriately sized space. Uh, you do wanna make sure that the bar is center to the table and also um, it should be mounted below the display, not above it. How about final thoughts? One of the things to call out is this is an all-in-one video bar. So you're not going to be bringing the output of this video bar into a, you know, a computer running a video conferencing codec or anything like that. That's all already built into the bar.